Okay, so once you've got the top or the bottom of the turntable off, you'll be greeted with this inside. Um, what we're looking at uh, disconnecting is basically this plug here. Um, it's pretty straightforward. Just there's a little clip underneath. Kind of just push it out with a flat braided screwdriver, and then what I've done with mine is just tucked it back in this little clip like this it's difficult doing it one-handed but anyway you'll get the gist of what I'm trying to achieve just so that is out of the way properly and then what I would do is check the connections you've got one here one here there's one that runs under the preamp itself which is actually soldered onto this board which is a bit pants um, and you've got four connections in here as well so the ground for the turntable doesn't actually run directly to the post it comes down to um, this little screw here and then it travels along the metal part of the turntable so I've just kind of nipped these screws up uh, just to check everything is tight check the ones here here and here and then the other important thing that I would do is you've got this shielding on the cable here is is just make sure that the wires are kind of away from that shielding and make sure that it's soldered in I mean it's it's pretty rough to be honest it's not the best soldering I've seen check all along here and here and here make sure obviously all the wires are kind of soldered in properly um, once you've done that I'm, I think you'd be surprised how much better it is just remember that when you do want to use a turntable that you only use it with a switch on phono not on the line switch or else it won't actually do anything um, one last little bit that I would do is on your um, cartridge itself if you just before you put everything back together um, on mine if you have a look in the four little pins in there just um, do it with the power off but just make sure that those are actually all springing back just get a very very small flathead screwdriver and push each one of those in and out and then um, when you put your cartridge on if you basically um, put the cartridge in first and then push back on it so that it is actually undoing it and you'll get a, like a clunk and then do your cartridge up you'll get a much better seat on there once that's done they sound much much better but just remember that the table will only work on uh, Phono mode. Alright, hope it helps.